Hi guys, it's Inam Kafour here with the Samsung Galaxy S3 and what we're going to be doing in this video is showing you how to create folders on uh, this operating system being uh, Android Ice Cream Sandwich version 4.0.4 .4. and the, the main aim of this is just so that you can group your applications together in more of an orderly fashion so for example if you've got a bunch of games and instead of having them sort of scattered on the screen in various icons you can group them together in a folder so you can just go to one location and pull them out rather than having to find which one it is through your various pages so first of all what we do is I'm going to go into my apps app launcher here and I've got uh, you can see I've got a host of uh, folders already there so if I just show you what I've got in the multimedia one which is I've got various uh, multimedia files like music players video players in here and what we're going to be doing is recreating one of, one of those so I've got three apps there called Quadrant, Velma and Tutu. And what we're going to be doing is creating a folder called Benchmarks and putting them all in there. And what you do first of all, once you're here, you hit Menu, you'll see Edit. Within the menu, hit Edit and the screen kind of pulls back a little bit. You'll see Save, Cancel, Edit at the top and little plus signs between the icons there. And what I'm going to show you is if you want to pick the application that you want to group first of all, hold it down and you'll notice along the bottom here you'll have a, a folder symbol there um, I think it's a page symbol there, an information symbol there and an X there. Now if I hold that down obviously there you go obviously X is to remove that application and it'll say you'll go through the uninstall process I is obviously information and if you drag and drop it onto there it'll give you the information about the app that, that is a new pane itself like a page pane um, like you got there I've got two pages but there'll be another one and the end one there is the folder one so all you do is drag it on top of the folder and then you notice where the folder or where the application was initially a folder is there now containing the small icon of uh, the application and you can see there's no name to it though so to give it a name you tap on top of it it opens it up and you can see it says unnamed folder along the top so you tap where it says unnamed folder we'll give it a name called benchmarks benchmarks there we go and we'll hit done and then it's there we go now there's two ways in which you can add other applications to this folder you've got the plus symbol there which will tap and then it puts little square boxes on the remaining apps and you can just simply tick the ones that you want and then once you wanna you've selected all the ones that you wanna put in that particular folder you hit done and you can see it moves them there or the other way you can do it is hold down an app and then just let it go on top of the folder and you can see it puts it inside so if we go inside the folder now just to see what's in there you can see there's the Antutu one benchmark there that we put in that we started with there's a Velimo one that we clicked the plus sign and added it and there's a quadrant one where we dragged and dropped it into the folder now that's done just hit back a second so we go through uh, to the main screen here at the top if you just hit back and come out of this that won't be saved what you've just done so to save what you've just done and keep that folder you hit save in the top right of the screen and there we go so if I just come out of that go to the home and go back into the app launcher and you can see the folder is still there called benchmarks and that's how easily you can create folders to group your applications on the ice cream sandwich operating system on the Samsung Galaxy S3 here. Any questions or comments that you guys have got, hit them up in the comment section down below there. Hit subscribe from the button up top there. It doesn't cost you anything and it's free and you can check out what I'm doing in the future. Thanks for watching, have a good day and goodbye.